Hi and welcome back to a kids workshop. Uh, I have hoped we would have finished this uh, guy trebuchet last week, but uh, we had problem with the video mixer and it wouldn't work. So and uh, this I had to shut down because the mic are not too good either to to change. So, but no further delay. So we will go on. And just before I, I will change the camera. Just before I, uh, I uh, got on. Then uh, I broke this one because I did it a little tight and by the way I have uh, I have made a little more uh, distance between the show so uh, I have time to to uh, time to time to set up between so I if anything happens I can manage to do something about it so now it should be better and by the way it wasn't my fault with the video browser it was wirecast so I will move this a little because after I started to fix it they come out with an update where they fix the camera issue I had every time I changed change the camera the, the everything broke down so but it should do that now so <laughs> just before I got on I tried to press it down and then uh, the wheels split and opened up so we will do it like this a little more room between the stuff so See, I still press it too much. Keeping everything together, right? I 
<laughs> too little and too much. We can squeeze it a little. In a little while. When we get this one on. Keep it against the hold it a little. Where do we have a stick? So You can see here we have one wheel and we have another there and change and see that's uh, one for those of you who haven't This one too. And let's see. No. I'll go over here and get as you have seen in the other episodes, uh, they are not always the same thickness, so be careful when you buy them and when you regardless what size you buy them in uh, you can take them a little smaller or a little bigger that's no matter as long as they all are the same but but uh, they also each of them has to have uh, the same uh, this one is nine times nine millimeters so and it fits this one and then we sand it afterwards but this way see it's the same height as this round rim of the wheel so but now we will take Turn it upside down and uh, and uh, one of the spokes uh, I will let go all the way through and then uh, to half. you have seen in the other uh, shows you have seen and we did it with the 
with this one. But uh, to do it faster, I will take my other saw and move to machine it instead. Turn the mic a little, and I know when the light is kind of harsh, but uh, we have to do that. To get it, there is not much you can see. And we will change to this one. Yes. And you can see it's a little too big. tendency to make them very tight so and that's why I broke them because you know the when you press this way the circle have no uh, strings but the other way it has a lot of strings this way here. No. No. Has to be gentle. And this was not the one. And of course you don't have one of these, so you, uh, I don't think so. You have to sand it by hand, but 
that's not that difficult. See, now we need to make the spokes this way. And you can see I do a little outside so that I can do it. So I have it as And then I write one on this one and two on this one and then I say one up here because now they kind of fit together. So, so what piece goes where? <coughs> ah, thread on the power supply. I know there's no good light over here, but I need to be able to see. Maybe this is a little better. It is. Change the camera and turn the mic and change the camera and turn the mic. See, this was two. This, I think this is good enough now.
Ein. Ein. Where is the other one? It's here. Number one. Need very little. So, and the last one. <coughs> Keeps crumpling on the power supply to the camera. And the grain are this way, you can see. the light but I know this is the worst place I think I need to paint this black so the light are not going in it's like this but uh, you not do that now
change again. Oh, now I forgot to make this where I wanted it, so I have to do that now. Do it here. Between those. Yes. But as you know, you can see all the other videos and see how we got to where we are today, right? So We will go and saw again. Just cutting.
this. me where things don't end up like you want then make them over again don't be afraid to do that Shall we see? Yes, it is too big. It's supposed to be too big.
You can see you have to be careful. That's why I'm be careful not to get too close to these with my fingers. Why? So some glue maybe maybe I should have extensive amount of glue everywhere. And do like this. See, now we have four of these wheels here. Now we only have to put a hole in the middle that fits with the, the axle, the stick we are going to put through it. Now we will put this out again, I know, you get seasick, seasick, but uh, no you don't because you cannot see what I am doing, because I changed where this one stood. So. And as you can see, we have the, this stick here, I'll use this hand, and we have to put these wheels on here, and like, can you see this, yes, like this one, on here, in between, this, and this, and this, and then all of those we put, not this one, this, these we have to put in between them, if we say here, oops, like so, and those we cut last time
and we put okay there are room for them but uh, I will not have the problem taking them out again something wrong in this hole Oh, that's because that's the part I glued together. I will, that's all I will drill up again. Drill one more time. You can see now I have the space between them like this one. Right? They are a little bigger but you they are too big too. Oh it's fine here. They're obvious obviously smaller over there. And then a hole and then they running around here and we can lift up the that guy and we can hang that one on it so but uh, we need to drill some holes so we need to figure out how thick I cannot remember something like that uh one is five millimeters real bit and what is this it's only four point five we need five millimeters This would be 5mm. Yes. And of course you have to do it with a handhold if you don't have one of those here that I have. And we will go over here. guy over here. Yeah. If I do like this and move this and then this is uh, a backwards like this. It's kind of tilting and stuff. We'll take this one first. I will suggest that uh, that you use a smaller drill bit at the first that I do here. But and maybe that will bite me
it sometimes does when you do things like this, it come and bite you. See? Now I will hold this one on top of it. So I'm sure that I get the hole precisely the same place. flat on the, and not on top of some, some of the stuff. We should have one wheel here and we will go out here so you can see what we are doing. And right. See now we have a wheel who fits on the stick here. Or oh, that was at least what we thought. Okay, we have to drill them up with the uh, 0.5. Ah. Okay. Make sure it is a 0.5. Five point five millimeters was the stick. It's stick because the stick has to turn around so it can wire up the that part but uh, now we can put these in <coughs> without any fear of they getting stuck in there but first, before I do that, I will uh, I will send them. What that part? Oops. So that they look nice. Right. 
to have these plain with the rim it only take a couple of minutes but it works it looks more, so much nicer need to put any glue on this because they kind of the holes are so tight that not necessary see and then it's just to push all of them through and hope it hits a hole on the other side, that's a good thing, if they do. And if they don't, then it's because you have not hold the, hold the drill right when you did it. You can make it a little, little bit get it to fit them a little Ok. 
Okay. That's way too thick. Or we need to do lower. The sticks are not all the same. Same thickness. They are cheap grill sticks, so what can you expect? Go in there. So Too difficult, some of them too difficult to put in there. You can put a drill bit through one more time and then see if, if that helps. But uh, don't use violence because it, then it kind of breaks. As you can see, I can uh, do that all evening, because we have two and I need a hole in the middle, but tomorrow I have done this and mounted them on so we can can uh, can get on with uh, uh, the kind of, what shall we call it, Oops. The, the guy, guy who throws it all. all. And then uh, the throw, and then we have some uh, small things in the front we have to make uh, the ejector and uh, and then a little rope work. But uh, this will take uh, a little time, but uh, not uh, not uh, days or weeks. But uh, we'll see how far we get tomorrow, right? I will thank you for joining me tonight and uh, I have another show in a half an hour and uh, I'm happy I have the time to so but uh, look at the schedule and you can see and for those of you who have some ideas go to the comment chat uh, on pixelfantasy.com and uh, you can put comment ideas and what not to what to the next we are gonna do as you have seen is jewelry but uh, uh, a necklace but uh, whatever we are gonna make a lot of fun things so see you tomorrow